hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new welcome to you and if you're old thank you so much for coming back so today i'm running a couple of errands going to pretoria to get the stuff changed in here um i hope it goes well because apparently i was supposed to go on friday but i'm only going on tuesday so come with me let's go to pretoria yay finally i got a taxi you know taxi life in south africa it's so different from cameroon taxi life cameroon taxi life you can literally get a taxi in front of your house but in south africa you always have to go to where the taxis are be it a taxi rank be it a street which taxis move a lot so from my place to the robot where taxis move a lot it's like 30 minutes so this entire area where the taxi is driving through i walked this area imagine now this is kempton park cbd which means central business i don't know what the d stands for but it's quite a busy area because it's morning it's not so busy yet but during the day it gets extremely busy and you would mostly find nigerians on the streets and that's why some people have decided to call this area lagos because there are a lot of nigerians who run their businesses in kempton park cbd and as you can see people are walking into the rank because at times walking into the rank it's quicker as you want to catch up you know with the queues you don't want to be far behind because in the taxi rank there are a lot of taxis local taxis you know going to different places so you don't want to be far behind at the queue especially if you're late and in this area you've got to be super careful with the gadgets that you have you've got to walk super quickly you know because it goes down it goes down abruptly and when they rob you you never know <laughs> and as you can see people are selling because it's quite busy i want to believe that they also make profit or they make good business so yeah this is the taxi rank and i finally arrived well get a taxi to pretoria
All right, there's a tip I just came out from. Um, back from my errand day. Not much, look at the streets. The streets is so quiet because people are at work, you know. So I decided to change the style of my cat. Um, so I'm back from Pretoria. Um, basically, I took uh, two, yeah, I took five taxis from Riedel, where I stay, to Marabasta, Pretoria. So, first of all, I took a local taxi um, to Captain Park Taxi Rang. It was like 16 rands. And then I took um, Kempton Park taxi rank to Pretoria. That was 27. And then from Pretoria, when I was done, um, I had to take a local taxi in Pretoria to be able to get to the Kempton Park taxi rank in Pretoria. You understand? So that was 15 rands. And then I paid from Pretoria. Um, that was Bosman. Um, so basically I took, yeah, from Bosman, um, I went to, from Bosman I came back to Kempton Park, and from Kempton Park I came back to Bridal. So in total, all of this trip, I took five taxis, um, everything cost me around 102 rand, and um, I left, I took my first taxi around 7 or so, to 7, now it's around to 11. Um, or 11 or past 11 so let's say 7 8 9 10 7 8 no, 8 9 10 yeah so basically it took me like four hours by taxi and also getting the things that i wanted to do the clouds are so beautiful anyhow guys that was my day today four hours out to pretoria and one thing i must say guys like pretoria is very clean pitori go oh. Yo, Pitori is very clean. Even like their CBD, which is like, because in Joe Break, like it's a mess. Yeah, bro? But in Pitori, like the CBD is so clean. It's so proper. Like people are busy doing their businesses, but like everywhere it's super clean. You know, that tells that you are in the capital city. Okay? You're in the capital. And also, Pretoria has got like a lot of um, like government buildings. Like you find like Ministry of Basic Health. All the ministries, their offices are mostly in Pretoria. In Pretoria, sorry. So that's it for me. Um, if you want me to, to show you such content, definitely another thing as well, the roads are clean, beautiful. Um, if you've watched up until this point, please subscribe. Tell me if you want to see more of South Africa. Because God has been faithful to me. I've been across, um, I've been across all nine provinces. And yeah. And most of the most days of my life I'm on the road. So if you want to see my life more often, let me know. But that's it from me. Please subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. And turn on your post notification because I'm out. Alright. And bye. Ooh, I thought I'm doing a picture, but it's a video. And let me show you how all I'm dressed. I'm dressed like a cat because I knew that. Um, it was gonna get hot later in the day. Um, in the morning, I had to wear a jacket because it was cold. But now it's hot, but I'm almost home. So, and I also wanted the jacket to be able to put this purse inside my jacket. Because, girl, boy, one thing when you're going around in taxis, you've got to be careful. You've got to dress like you're from the streets, okay? You cannot be looking so proper, super proper. I might become a victim of robbery, okay? So, I have this big jacket to put to my purse inside. Like, I wore my purse inside the jacket. I had a cap as well, because number one, my hair is not so good. And then, two, I knew it was going to get hot during the day. So, I knew that, like, by the time I come back during the day, I can take this off. But definitely, the weather, we're in spring, they say, but it's winter in the morning summer in the afternoon yeah bro so i get a mixed motion jay so i thought i'd say that